guys, welcome back to my channel. It is the end of June, which means I'm back filming another What I Spend um, in a Month, and this is Baby Edition, so this is all the things I bought for my baby in the month of June. I did this last month for May, so if you want to check out that video, I'll leave it in the description. Um, it's a bit of a mixture this month between um, clothes, he's going into um, three to six month clothing and I did a big shop in Tesco's, not yesterday, the day before and got him some new toys and stuff. It's also been really, really hot weather so we've been buying things like summer hats, um, sunshades for the car and stuff so without further ado I will get stuck into it. I'm going to tell you the price of everything as I go along and then um, I will have the total spend at the end of the video. So the first items are from H&M. He has already worn these two. They came in a pack of three, um, a little romper, so they're buttoned all the way down. I love this one. This is my favourite one out of the set. It's got a little giraffe, zebra and like a tiger on it. And then it comes with this one, which he's also worn. They're a little bit creased. Um, and then it comes with this one, which he hasn't yet worn. That was a little three pack. And then I also got him some little, um, what do you call it, short sleeve bodysuits. These are in the size four to six months. Um, I mainly got them because I love this one because it's got little turtles on it. And if you know our inside joke, Tommy looks like a little turtle, specifically the one from Finding Nemo. When he smiles, he just looks like a little turtle. So all of these items came to £22.98 and that was from H&M. I've kept the box for this to show you. Um, this is the Metanium Everyday Easy Spray Barrier Lotion from Morrisons. This is the best thing ever. We use the Metanium like nappy ointment, the one in the yellow tube, when he has um, like quite an angry nappy rash, which isn't too often, but if it flares up, then we use the yellow one, and it clears up really well. Um, and I saw in Morrison's that they did one in a spray, which is so handy because it means you don't have to get your fingers mucky. Um, that's how much we've used of it so far, just literally to the line. And this was £4.50, I think it was on offer, um, and it was from, yeah, Morrison's. I don't really need to keep it in the box anymore, I just kept it, kept the box for the purpose of the video. But it says, six changes a day, 30 days, um, like on average. It says two sprays should be enough to protect the skin so yeah really enjoying using this next thing are some socks again these are newborn um but they do like stretch quite a lot the socks that we currently have are dark gray and black i think so i wanted to get some blue ones to match some of the outfits that he wears and these ones were £2.50 cheap and cheerful they've got the little grippy stars on the bottom then I had a little bit of a splurge on Vinted. I bought these three um, rompers from Next. He has worn all of these already. Um, and these, I did unbox these in a vlog that I think should be up by the time you're watching this video. Um, this one as well, I think this one's my favourite. So all of these three rompers from Next on Vinted were £6.23 and that was including delivery. These are in three to six um, months and they fit him really well, really really good quality and yeah really good seller they came really really quickly. Also from Vinted um, we picked up some of these little teething toys, um, I kept the box again um, just to show you what it looked like. These are Newbie um, Icy Bites Keys and he obviously loves these because they're easy for him to hold and also you can put them in the fridge um, and then chew on the like gel keys um he likes to shake them and hold them so yeah these have been really good for him this was £4.96 from Vinted obviously it was brand new in the packet and that was with delivery as well another clothing item from Vinted this was £5.15 including delivery and this is the exact same um outfit that he has or that he wore when he was a newborn it's got the little teddy bear on the bum it's from Tesco's like brand new um I don't think they sell it anymore, I haven't found it in there for, haven't seen it in there for a while, so I got this in a 6 to 9, I do also want to get it in a 9 to 12 months because then that's like winter, um, just so I can like take pictures of him in the same outfit he wore when he was a baby, so yeah, really good condition again, almost literally brand new, I think the baby had only worn it once or twice. 
And the last item that I bought from Vinted this month was this brand new in a box Blossom Blossom um, The Very Hungry Caterpillar Baby Pillow Spray. I keep forgetting to use this and I've only used it probably like two times since I've had it. So when Tommy hit like 12, 13 weeks, he went from waking up once or twice a night to now waking up like three, four, five, six times a night. So I picked this one up. This one is suitable um, like from birth. Um, this is suitable for newborns and I've just actually seen it says suitable for people who may be prone to eczema. Um, there is one by Child's Farm but it's not, um, it's for babies six months plus. So this one is suitable for newborns. I'm going to continue to use it and see if it makes a difference. And this one was £4.96 with delivery. So because we've been having some really hot weather, me and my mum and Tommy went to the beach a few weeks ago and I needed to get him a hat that had a strap under the chin because the summer hat that he has um, is too big and it just falls off all the time. So I got this two pack um, navy and like a lighter blue from Tesco's and these ones were £8. And then just as a backup in case those didn't, um, didn't work, I got these in three to six months and these were eight pounds um, and they have the like neck shade bit at the back so yeah I'm probably going to keep these for um, like summer summer because they will fit his head a bit better then. I really like the pinstriped one that's my favourite one. Because we were going to the beach I picked up this fan, this clips onto um, well, essentially anything, it's like a desktop fan. Um, but I wanted one with a clip so that I could clip it to the push chair. Um, it's got three settings, so you just push the button on the back. So one, two, three. Like it's actually quite strong. Um, it comes with a rechargeable battery, um, and then it comes with a cable, like a mini USB, and you charge the battery. It. I haven't charged it since we used it when we went to the beach, which was about two weeks ago. Um, the clamp is really, really strong. Um, and this was about £10, let me double check the price, this one was £10.19 and I got it on Amazon Prime, it literally came the next day and you can get it in different colours as well I think. Also from Amazon these were £6.89, these are the Newbie Fruitsicle um, Lolly Moulds, I'm planning to make some breast milk ice lollies the reason i haven't used these yet is because by the time they came or by the time i'd ordered them the really hot weather went away so this is what they look like perfect size um like molds and they've got really big chunky handles for him to hold i'll probably do a video about um like making these and um his first impression and whether he likes them or not so if you want that video then let me know in the comments and i will definitely film that i'm really excited to make them for him also from Amazon, I have this big, massive box of 18 wipes. Um, these are Huggies. These are the 100% pure, I'm not sorry, 99% pure water wipes. These are the only ones that we found to agree with Tommy's skin. Um, we used the Audi extra sensitive ones when he was a newborn and he got really, really bad nappy rash. So we've stuck to these ones now. And for a pack of 18, these were £10.98. Um, and if you watched my video last month, I bought a box of nine. Oh no, sorry, I bought a box of 12 and it cost me £9. So for an extra pound, um, I have so many more. And I have now signed up to the subscribe and save um, thing on Amazon. So I will get this box delivered um, every two months now. From Halfords, I picked up these um, pop-up sunshades. The windows in the back of my car are actually slightly tinted um, but I just wanted a bit more protection so the sun wasn't in his eyes and also it gives him something to look at and they were £5.76. They've got really nice like brightly coloured pictures on there and this was a two pack so one is in my car and then one is in Connor's car. These were a really good purchase this month. And then now I'm going to move on to all the things I bought from Tesco. This is a bit of a random mixture of toys, a few clothes, nappies. Um, I've got the receipt with me here. I did also buy some bread and yogurts and stuff like that. Um, so I spent £85.95 in total. But that obviously includes all the food as well. So I will let you know the prices individually. 
we picked up the Child's Farm Hair and Body Wash. I didn't realise that the scented ones are suitable for newborns. So we've been using the like specific baby one that's not scented. Um, and I used this on him in his bath yesterday. It's the Blackberry and Organic Apple. And he smells good enough to eat. It smells so good. Um, yeah, I was a bit iffy about using um, fragrance on him, but he has a bath. Um, every other day or every two days so I'm not using it too often on him it does stay suitable for sensitive skin and then along this we use the Child's Farm Baby Moisturiser so this one was £4 and then also on the um, subject of bath this is the Nightly Adventures by Sam Fairs Milk Bath Bubbles and this is Blackberry and Apple I'm really loving um, Blackberry scented things at the moment I haven't used this yet but it smells amazing and this one was £3. We've got a pack of nappies. These are size 3. He is still in size 2. He hasn't long gone into them. But these were on offer for £5.50. So um, we just picked up a pack of 42. Um, so that we have these ready for him when he's on the next size. Really, really excited for him to try this. Um, it's the Matchstick Monkey Teething Toy and Gel Applicator. Um, it's coming up at... £10.50 although I think it did have 50p off or a pound off maybe um, so yeah it was about £10 I think um, we've got the grey one it looks really easy for him to hold I'm going to wash this in like warm soapy water and then give this to him because he's definitely teething at the moment if we have any more hot weather soon I wanted to make sure that I had some sleeveless body suits um, this is pack of five plain white ones and these were five pounds he's moved up into the sit up bit in his um, push chair he absolutely hated the bassinet part now that he can roll over he really hated being flat on his back so we got this spiral toy um, to go on the bar of the push chair and this was eight pounds we've had this on the push chair for a few days now his favorite thing is this little um, like textured green ring um, and then it's got a little mirror on it also um, and then a little leopard in the middle picked up some clothes again this is in three to six months so this is for like the peak of summer this two-piece set was ten pounds i think he looks really nice in this like sage green color and then we picked up these as well in three to six this was also ten pounds little lion king rompers um, and then that one underneath I also picked up a buggy clip, this was £5, I'm going to use this um, on the handle of the push chair to put like shopping bags, nothing too heavy because I'm like petrified of the push chair tipping up um, and I couldn't put our nappy bag on the back because that's always really heavy with so much stuff in it but light shopping bags, um, yeah I've wanted to get one of these for a while and this was only £5. Nearly at the end um, I got a, another item from Newbie, I really like this brand and this is a um, bath time book. So it's like a waterproof book and this was, let me see, £3 and of course I got it because it had a little turtle on the front. Last two things, um, this is a high chair toy, um, We or I sit him in his high chair when I'm cooking dinner so that he can be in the kitchen with me. Um, he now obviously like is quite good with holding his head up. Um, obviously I strap him in and make sure that I'm supervising him, him at all times but I just thought that this would be fun for him to play with and look at it suctions on to the high chair tray and then he can like roll it and then it's got all different pictures on it and this one was, what did I say, eight pounds? oh six pounds this one, six pounds and then last but not least I got some munchkin spoons this is for when we start weaning um, and these ones were three pounds forty five so I'm already aware that this video is quite long, so I'm going to finish the video here. I will put the total, monthly total, on the screen, and give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you next month for what I spent in July.